Hello and welcome back to the channel. We are ready to another opening of Flesh and Blood. And I just kicked the camera. <laughs> to another opening of Uprising Flesh and Blood. I see this is our third box from the same case and we having some bad results. I didn't get anything worth like, I don't know, a bazillion bucks or something. It has been really bad, those openings. I don't know if it's this case is cursed. You tell me. I'm going to destroy this box. And, well, I'm waiting for outsiders. That's about it. As we can just say for ourselves. I want to, uh, outsiders and that's it. I want outsiders. I mean, I, I'm fed up with uprising and I don't know I want new cards exciting cards and cards that are worth money big bucks and that's it <laughs> isn't that all that we want <laughs> good cards amazing cards cards that just make your play even better and Make huge plays. And another rare, and a rare. Ooh, and a common. Uh, eh. Common slot, rainbow foil. And that's it. Same old, same old. Uprising, it's been like this forever. Just a pile of burn. Well, the flame, the, the, Ah, I'm missing the word. The Phoenix will help in burning everything up. But we could take some a Majestic and another common. So it has been quite an eventful, an eventful. I don't know. What's your opinion on this set? Maybe it's just me. I'm having an enormous amount of bad luck. And just saying the words just give me the chills because I really can't expect anything else from these boxes that only can be like pure junk. <laughs> but uh, like all TCGs in the future, this can make a turnaround and the cards can become quite important. It's not that unexpected or not new to have something like that. Um, but in unboxing, uh, I don't know. It has passed a lot of time since this box came out. We want organized play to make this exciting for all the players. The game is still in an embryonic state. Uh, is that what you think? I don't know. I don't know. Can someone comment and tell me about the future of organized play of flesh and blood? Because I would love to see a lot of people playing more games this year. Since there, there's been like a... I don't know. Uh, something like an immense amount of TCGs flooding the market right now. Oh, Evoke. Uh, and from a few TCGs, we now have everything because every series, every anime has a TCG and they are all over the place. And uh, the percentage of success. Woo, nice majestic uprising. Woohoo! Yeah, there you go, there you go. There's some value. There's some value. But the large quantity of TCGs fail. That's the truth. And most are, um, I don't know, like. Uh, Regional, but uh, if you think in worldwide terms, they are, for example, Japan, you have a lot of um, TCGs that only work there, and the US, a lot of TCGs that only work there, and 
I call it regional, but uh, it's about worldwide, so it's countrywide, countrywide regional. <laughs> I don't know. Give me a better term. I can live with it. And I would like to see this one make it. Uh, they have a cool formula to balance the cards instead of just power creeping, power creeping, power creeping into oblivion and then the cards just keep on stacking abilities and things they do and well at some point you have a card like in Yu-Gi-Oh with uh, a text that you can no longer see and a ton of abilities and effects that happen at the same time and I don't know <laughs> maybe the cards instead of textless you forget the picture <laughs> and just go wide and you just only want text and that feels more like a proxy than a card to me so where, where is this design where, where are these images Cool, look at this, dust up, look at the dragon and on the back, come on, you can have cards, I'm going to put the the Fey there, but you cannot have cards without drawings, because part of our memory, it works like that, with images, and part of our memory works with text, so you can evoke and remember both from, ooh, nice, from the back of your head, just consulting the name of the card or woo nice cold foil cold foil here silent stilettos <laughs> ninja style a stiletto but as i was saying it's just our memory and the the games just reflect the way we see we think and that's really cool and who doesn't like for players who play TCGs, right? Who doesn't like to that, do that riffle shuffle? That shuffling of the cards and passing them, them around and in the back of your mind just project a turn and see what you're going to do. That's the... No, that's the... The, the real thing, you know, the real deal when you when you know you're playing a, a card game, you can feel it, you can touch it not like the digital digital can be more faster, more or less time consuming but here you have the the people element you can play the person like a bit like poker or you can see what is in his hands for what he did before, or you can predict his turn from what he's been playing, and the, only if you had draw that card that you'll be in dire straits. Otherwise, you will be good and just continue playing and executing your plan. So. Well, this box has been opening in a swoop, like a maniac. Woo! Until now, we have a majestic uh, rainbow foil. Yeah, rainbow foil and a cold foil stiletto. So, it's all the same. You got these hits, and if it's not something like magical, in a, a sense of an incredible magical card you just lose it all yeah oh and a rare so i was really under the impression that uprising or, or sorry flesh and blood boxes will be more profitable but i guess this that's only on the um, first edition boxes then you have, uh, and I think the history pack, it's really cool thing. You can design it. It's designed to put people back or start the game. So let's see how the future develops for that because it's like a master set. Woo, nice, coronet peak. 
Woohoo! Whoa, that was what I was talking about. Woo, a nice rainbow. These 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 cards are amazing. Okay, these cards, the design of these cards, it's really something out of the blue. Out of the blue. This was a nice pick. I don't expect anything else here. We, we are about done with the box, and I hope that one will put me over the top in terms of value because otherwise. And we fill it again. So that's the third box from our case. And there you have it. There you have it. All the marbles in one place. And still, I don't know. I don't see it. I need to check the price on Carnet Peak. But otherwise, well, wish me luck for the final one. It will be up soon, and I'll see you all guys and girls in a bit. Thank you. Bye-bye for now.